Hi, welcome to my pastel painting session. I'm going to be working on pastel board. I, If it's white, I start with a underpainting. So I put on a little bit of pastel and the colors that I'm going to be working with. Sometimes I use complementary colors, but in this case I decided to just use the base color that we will be working over. I put on uh, all over the painting. Then I get a brush and some water and I work on there. When I work outside, I usually start in the lighter area and work into the dark, but at home I have plenty of water to rinse out my brush, so I just started at the top and worked down. It doesn't matter if it drips, um, it's going to be covered over anyway. So that's the way I start out. Then when I start working on the painting, I try to develop it a little bit all over. I usually start with the harder pastels, like new pastels, um, then work up into the softer pastels and use the very light Senelay or Ludwig for the highlights. In this case, I was developing the rocks and starting on the water a little bit here and there. I worked on to the waves and I wasn't very happy with the way they were coming out. But I went on, I uh, decided I'd try it, see how it would develop. As I was working, I began to notice that I didn't have much volume in the waves. and I had everything kind of lined up in a row. So I decided that I would just start over. So I brushed off the paint with a paintbrush, or the pastel. Then I wipe it with a towel. And then I get my water and I underpaint it just like I did at the beginning. It takes about 10 minutes for the water to dry, maybe a little bit longer. In some areas, it's been very dry here, so it dried pretty quickly. I put it back up on the easel. I have aluminum foil under there to catch the pastel dust. And these are the pastels I was using. I added only a couple more um, light Ludwigs for the highlights near the end. As I said, I like to work all over the painting. I um, don't blend very much. I use the pastels for blending if I have to feel like I want to blend. If you blend with your hands too much, it takes away the brilliance from the pastels because they get smushed together. As I was working, beginning to work into the waves, I touch a little bit to knock down the thicker pieces of pastel, but I decided I needed more volume. <clears throat> so to give it more volume, I decided I'd work in some deeper shadows, started with a little blue and a little lavender. And that seemed to work. It helped give more volume and water shape to the waves. I try to use different types of strokes, <clears throat> different directions in the water especially, to give it the wavy look, watery look. Try to use color all over the place. I went ahead and signed it and then I still kept working on it, which is my usual pattern of behavior. After I'm finished, I take it outside and take a picture in direct sunlight for pastels. That seems to work better, and I need very little color correction to come in and work on it in the computer after that. I added a few final touches, and there it is. Thanks for watching.